All right, I just lost two straight games. Let's hope we get put up against an easy opponent. Oh, gosh. Okay, this again me interesting. Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another MBPI 2019 video. It is Shimp from the Shimp Place. It was popping up. You're having a good day. And today, we're going to be going up against uh, Himston against a live game. So, what that means is that this game actually counts for stuff. I randomly got put up against him. Kind of scared, not gonna lie. But we're gonna go out here and play our best baseball against him. We're gonna treat him like every other opponent. As we'll pop out to the first baseman, Jeff Bagwell. He has Tom Seaver on the mound, who is, I would say, the best pitcher in this game. And he has him as a plus two um, ranked up. Let's just say that he throws a whole lot of sinkers this game. It, so, yeah, he's cheesing, but... I mean, you gotta do what you gotta do. He's number two in the world as of when I filmed the video, so... You know, man's gotta do what a man's gotta do, right? Here we go. So, we got a base hit and a left. Dude, we, got, we got a really big hitter at the plate now. Our best hitter, Adrian Gonzalez. Exactly the guy I want up now. He starts us, us off with the sinker, though. I will give him some props here because he did not um, spam the sink the not sinker, the slurve in this game at all. He I think he threw one, one slurve to me. But yeah, I knew I had to go full sweat against him. I was going to give Tyson Ross a very short, short leash. And Tyson Ross has uh, reached the end of his leash with a big hitter at the plate. Honestly, everyone in his lineup is a big hitter. We're bringing in Craig Stammen because he has a sinker. We're going to give him a taste of his own medicine. 2-2 Two -two pitch to Burks now. Hit on the ground to first. We're going to get the sure out. It pushed Gonzalez forward, so... I had to go for the sure out. Popped up into shallow left. Galvis, plenty of time. Now 2-2 pitch to Jeff Bagwell. Hit on the ground to second. Routine play to first in time. So now it's still no score in the game. Yeah, I'll give him props. He didn't really cheese me as hard as he could have. But yeah, here is Solarte. Hit to center. That is going to be an out. So now two strikes to the DH Will Myers. And that is the only slurf he throws in the game. You can see how filthy it was. If he actually threw it, I would have no chance at all. Honestly, you don't have much of a chance anyways. If we got, if we got a run though, we're going to keep it. We're going to keep it. As we actually get a strike out there of Kinner. Now Chipper Jones coming up to bat. He hits that one into right, falling fast, but Renfro tracks it down in time. Nice couch out there. Now Andrew Jones, the center fielder. He drives that one to center, Mabin going back, and he makes a diving catch there. Nicely done, Mabin. We need good defense in this game if we want to stay in it. We can't have any errors. We can't really give up any mistakes. Now here's Mabin. Sinker misses inside for ball one. Can't give him any free hits. A team like this will certainly capitalize on any errors. And he's setting up his pitch as well, which makes it hard. But to get number two in the world, you got to have a good team and you got to have good skill. And you got to have a big wallet. Let's be honest here. Strike two to Cameron Mabin. The 2-2 pitch on its way from Seaver. It's hit to third and an unnecessary dive by Chipper Jones. I'm sure Seaver appreciates it nevertheless. Nick Hunley on first. Hit on the ground. That, and they get the sure out at first. 1-1 one, one pitch to Upton. Swung on and missed. 1-2 now. And popped up third. Jones catches. We're going to the bottom of the ninth. Himston is looking to try to walk it off against me. Stammen is trying to hold the game right where it is. Keep him scoreless. As that one's going to be hit out to right center field. It's going to bang off the wall. The center fielder actually gets there. I thought Renfro had a better uh, chance of getting that ball quicker. But now, 
The winning run is now on second base with nobody out. Johnny Bench, a dangerous hitter at the plate. He swings and misses at strike one. Gonna sh throw the sinker. He fouls it off. We have him down 0-2 now. The 0-2 pitch to Bench. Struck him out. Two strikeouts now for Sam. And that's a big strikeout there. 3-1 pitch to Altuve. Swung on and missed. Full count now. And the pitch. Struck him out. Back-to-back -back strikeouts for Stam, and He is looking on point right now. And we have Burks down 0-2. And he struck him out. Stammon, what a beast, honestly, bro. He gave up a leadoff double, then strikes out the side. There we go. You'll love to see it against the second best person in the world right now. Quick out number one there. Adrian Gonzalez coming to the plate now. You can tell something big's coming. I can feel it. Against Justin Wilson who can throw 103 miles an hour. That's insane. Swung on a miss there. One ball, one strike. To the left-handed hitting first baseman, Adrian Gonzalez. The pitch. Swung on a miss, one, two. This Justin Wilson card doesn't have any cheesy pitches, but the velocity just makes it so devastating to face. 2-2. Two -two. Hit. 2. Altuve. Very soft line out. Two outs now. Last chance. Down to our final out to try to win the ball game. If not, we play for a tie. And swung on a miss for strike one. Two chase Headley. A one. So I'm going to miss strike two. Yeah, you see the 103 mile an hour fastball. And you see the slider. You can't. It's just kind of. Huh. Big yikes, big yikes. It's just gasoline. It's just filthy. It's not cheesy, though. It's not cheesy. I'm sure he has plenty of cheesy pitches down in the bullpen. 2-2 pitch to Chase Headley. And struck him out. So now we play for a tie. Craig Salmon going back on the mound to work. Four strikeouts for him and no earned runs. No runs at all in general. Hit down the left field line. That's going to be dropping foul. But Upton gets there in time. Kinner now. Strike two. 2-2 two -two pitch on its way. We're going to try to freeze him with the four seam fastball. And we strike him out swinging. Five Ks for Sam. And man, he is on point right now. My pitching is definitely better than my hitting. Or at least my pitching skills are. Hit the center. Dropping. Maven gets there in time. So we tie against the best play, the second best player in the world right now. So, you know, he was a, he is a good player. But, you know, he cheeses. But you gotta do what you gotta do to get top two in the world. But anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see you in the next one. Thank you for watching. Peace out.